Hey, I'm Steve Fullen. Let's take a look around the Hopshire Business Expo for 2013. Well, I think the people here today are incredibly passionate. And I think when you've got passion and self-belief and a good business, you can't go far wrong with that. Well, we're regular attenders, very strong supporters of the Hearts Expo and the Hearts Business Independent. It's always a great event to come along and meet fellow exhibitors, the marvellous training sessions that they run, the speakers, and also, most importantly, meet all the fabulous businesses that there are in Hertfordshire and the surrounding counties. How do you find coming to events like this in growing your business? It's very important to get out because, you know, there's only so much you can do within the office. It's great to get out, meet new businesses, network and, you know, hand out your cards and build those relationships. With very good point. Yeah, absolutely. There you go. Oh, thanks. Oh, wow. I feel, I feel like I've been outdone. So you obviously give a lot of advice to entrepreneurs, to businesses. Why would you advise them to come to something like this? Well, I think specifically if you're a business to business uh, and you offer a service to other businesses, what a better place than the Hertfordshire Business Expo to come and share what you do with other businesses. It's a great opportunity. Lots of businesses. Yes. You put <laughs> right in the middle. It's very useful because it allows me to interact with people, meet potential customers and also to get an idea about what other people in the, the field are doing as well. I would say you, you have to come to an exhibition like this for both exhibitors and for all of the people coming to have a look at what's an offer that this is probably one of the best social networking situations they can be in. You can even get your headshot taken here. If you're a startup or you're new to business and you don't know where to, where to start, then coming to somewhere like um, the Business Expo is a great starting point. You've got lots of services that can help you with your startup, lots of opportunities to talk to subject matter experts who can point you in the right direction for what you want to do. It's quite exciting actually, it's my first one, obviously, and being a new business as well. A bit nervous at first, but coming here has been great. One thing I like about our Hertfordshire businesses is everyone's trying to help each other. Hertfordshire is a fabulous place as well for business support. So yeah, it's just a great way of getting a, a, a greater source of information. Have you pinched any of the cupcakes yet on any of the stands? No, or? that's the next mission, yeah, to yeah. do the cupcake run. OK, right. Well, maybe we could be like do a cover for each other and uh, I'll distract them, you can grab them. OK, well, that's fine by me. <laughs> Everybody talks about keeping things local and unless you know what local is and what local has to offer and you only find that out by getting off your bus and coming to an exhibition like this. This is a business lounge, this is a pop-up hot office express. They want to sit down, they want to relax in a nice environment, high-speed Wi-Fi and to sit down at a desk so they could, they could get on with their working day. In a, in a lot of expo situations people come out for half a day and they're always rushing to get back to their office. So in this situation, they could walk around the expo and then come back to the lounge, pick up their emails, do a bit of work, maybe then go back into the expo again. So I'm here with Paul and Lucy. We're in the hot office area. Yeah, I know, nice. Um, what have you guys made of the expo today? We found it really interesting. We've been around the exhibition. We've met lots of interesting companies. Um, and we've just been listening to Dave Fishwick from the Bank of Dave as well, who's you know just given a really inspirational talk about how he set up his business and, and the Bank of Dave and everything. So it's been a really useful afternoon. Rule number three was, please never give up. And rule number four, never, ever give up. Because I promise you, it will work out for you. Actually, we meet lots of our good suppliers at shows like this. You, you unearth a bit of software that you think actually that real will really work. So, so I think there's some really good cross-trading occurring. I think you know it's good sometimes to work, we always say to work on the business, not just in the business. So and this we consider working on the business as doing something to, to move your business forward. And I think coming to the expo is a great way of doing that. Well, my job role as the senior business advisor is to attend these business exhibitions. Um, in particular, uh, we come to this one because it's got that real buzzy atmosphere. We also feel that we get eno enough delegates and new people of interest to come and justify us all being out for a, a good day. I think this kind of event just reminds people of the talent that's out there from a business point of view, the great companies that are out there, brings everyone together under, under one roof. You hear some inspirational stories, you hear what other companies are doing and how they're succeeding, so you learn from one another, and I think that's really important. And also you make some great connections as well, who can help you in your business, you can help them. So I think, you know, in, in many ways, it really helps. I might see if I can sneak this chair out. Quite <laughs> <laughs> if you were starting out again, would you bring your business to an expo like this? I think definitely. I think when I was starting, 
a million years ago, um, there was nothing like this. This sort of thing is where entrepreneurs are born, you know, and, and this, this sort of thing can really give somebody a push in that direction. So there you are, such a busy day at the Hertfordshire Business Expo, from the breakfast meeting to the seminars to the speed networking and, of course, the Bank of Dave Chat at the end. It's the Business Expo in Hertfordshire, but really means business. <laughs> <laughs>